There's an art in maths challenge questions of when to use trial and error on the answers and when to do something more complicated like algebra. It's one that you really only uh, master by doing lots of practice to really get the experience of having a good idea uh, as to which approach is going to be better. You could just go through and trial and error these and it wouldn't take you too long. It wouldn't be a bad approach. But I do think if you're just slick with algebra, you can dispatch this with algebra actually very quickly. I increase the number by 20%. That let's call the number x, so I've got 1.2x. I get twice as much as when I decrease 20 less than the number by 20%. So 20 less than the number is x minus 20. Decrease that by 20%, I multiply it by 0.8. And finally, I'm saying it's twice as much as, so I've got a two outside of the brackets here as well. Pause and really take that in if you need to. But now I've just got to multiply out the brackets and solve the equation, so I much prefer this way. 1.2x is equal to, well, 2 times 0.8 times x is 1.6x, and then I need 1.6 of, uh, of 20. 1.6 times 2 is 3.2, so that's 32. Uh, so I've got 32 is equal to 1.6x minus 1.2x, which is 0.4x, times it by 10, 320 is 4x, divide by 4 and get x equals 80, and we're done. Um, in your head, you can do that a lot faster probably than I say it out loud. If you prefer to do it by uh, checking each answer, you can do, but I really think uh, algebra is the best way to go for this question.